Hey Collective, it is me, Mystic Intellect, and I am here with a reading for today on what's in store for your Sunday. This is for everybody, so take heed of the messages, take what resonates, and please leave the rest, alright? So we're going to go ahead and get started here. I'm going to pull a different deck today to see what is it that Spirit wants you guys to know and what to look out for when it comes to your Sunday, okay? Now, I know we're already kind of in the middle of the day, but it doesn't hurt to see what else could be next. You know, what else could be in store to help you prepare for the rest of the week as well. So, it's not just about um today, but about how you could also uh, apply the energy for the rest of the week as well. So, let me put it in that way. All right. So, let's see, Spirit. Please give me a message for the collective concerning Sunday and how it may affect their week. So, we got Sunday being all about success strengthening your ability strengthening your um your strengths um growing and learning last but not least we got comfort here um what i'm picking up from this energy is that there's some okay that's what i'm seeing the leo energy that's coming through for this month and the next month is actually going to trigger a lot of growing energy. I'm picking up on new beginnings for the collective. So today, um, spirit wants you to like really get comfortable with um growing, with learning, with evolving, because you're never gonna stop finding out new things about yourself. You're never gonna stop building up strength. In places that you never thought that you would never build strength in. Your spirituality is showing up to be extremely important in this reading for today. Because a lot of you guys have a lot of options. A lot of possibilities. A lot of opportunities coming your way. And your strength is showing up here as like the most important card in this deck. Because it's paving the way for a lot of the opportunities going to be coming your way with the success card. With the success card. And then I'm also seeing a lot of you guys, like I just said, are discovering new things about yourself, but also tapping into other titles, other topics, and reading more books as well to like kind of like give yourself an understanding of things that you've been having in question. What else is in store for the collective for today? What's coming their way today? That could have an impact on their week. Boundaries and beauty. Some of you guys are working on your outer appearance. Focusing on becoming more successful in putting yourself first. Um, putting your boundaries before everything. I feel like a lot of you guys are limiting how much you are doing. And um, doing for others. And pouring that energy into yourself. Which is awesome. And today is all about accepting that it's okay to um to be selfish because you have to take care of you first before you can even pour any energy into other people next we have spirit guys showing up here it came out in reverse so it's showing me that a lot of you guys need to communicate with your spirit team more because there's a shit of there's there's something that is being blocked and it's because your spirit team is trying to contact you within uh, in your dreams about things that you have been in question about and spirit wants you to know that your dreams are something that you should not be afraid of dive deep into the meanings of your dreams and write down thoughts and feelings that come to mind when you think back to how you slept last night um i'm also seeing answers coming your way when it comes to the uh things that you have been questioning about on your own i'm seeing a lot of you guys are being more reliant on self this week when it comes to energy and how you're receiving and observing things this week, okay? What else is coming through for today? What else is coming through today for the collective? Some of you guys are letting go of what, what things used to be with somebody concerning a connection. I'm seeing that... Like, I, I, I'm seeing that somebody here is becoming more and more wise as time goes on with their life experiences. Today is going to be a really joyful day because I see someone rising above the negativity, rising above um, the challenges 
that have been your coming towards your way and i'm seeing someone becoming more of a sensitive healer someone becoming more compassionate and very supportive um of themselves and others but also with the king of swords boundaries and balance is showing up here so a lot of you guys are not going to be overgiving and not complicating things for yourself because you have done that a lot in the past where you compensated a lot for other people and it became a very a problem in the long run for yourself I'm seeing also someone getting out, having fun, going to a social gathering today. I'm also seeing, um, you know, someone actually coming to terms about a, a situation. I feel like you have nothing in common with a particular individual and you're going to actually make a decision to walk away even though it hurts because you're evolving and outgrowing this particular person or people. I'm seeing you still showing empathy for others. I'm seeing you embracing this new energy as it come, but I'm also seeing you also uh, receiving clear direction from your spirit guides. There's a masculine energy showing up as a spirit guide who is going to be helping you, steering you along your journey this week to help you motivate others, to help you also become even more decisive and more particular about what you want in your day, how you want your day to play out, how you want things to go in your business or in your work environment. And then I'm also seeing somebody putting in a lot of time and effort into something today that will pay off this week. It's spirit is saying to be patient, okay? So that's what I'm seeing within the energy of today. Take what resonates, please leave the rest. And if this energy vibe with you today, I pray that you um like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know how it resonates. And I look forward to better serving you guys. I'm going to be doing more Zodiac readings, so stay tuned for more. And yeah. I'm excited to see what this energy turns into for you guys this week because it looks like a lot of you guys have been really maturing spiritually, putting yourself first, understanding that, you know, there's just so much more in life that you can discover about yourself. And um, you're never going to be like you're never going to be too comfortable to the point where you're content. But I'm seeing that spirit do want you to get comfortable with getting uncomfortable because it's going to help you stay leveled. It's going to help you stay prepared as well for the changes that are coming, especially while we're in this recession energy, especially while we're in this uh, energy of opportunity, even though we're in a so-called recession. So, you know, take this opportunity to build yourself up more and grow and, you know, take your time if you have to. You don't got to rush, but you also still need to make sure you're on top of your goals. So here, you, there you have it, you guys. That's it. It's me, Mystic Intellect. Go ahead. And like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. Have a beautiful rest of your day.